Hey folks, Ken and the Data Monkey back again for another episode of Monkey Shorts. And in this week's episode, we are going to continue our quest to try and make it easier for a Data Monkey to see what they're doing when they're actually doing their work. Now, if you've worked with these tools for any amount of time, there's a, probably a pretty good chance that you picked up the scrolling DAX trick somewhere down the line. That's not new. It's been around for a long time. But what about inside Power Query? You may have tried that, right? So I'm going to hold down my control key right now and roll the mouse wheel up and nothing happens. And it's like, oh, that's a shame because I could really use some zoom in here as well. Well, here's the deal. Hold down the control key, hold down the shift key, and then press plus. And it actually zooms the entire Power Query window. Interestingly enough, if we go into view and advanced editor, you'll notice that that zoom did not take effect here. However, control shift plus it will actually go and zoom this in. Control shift minus, of course, will back you out a couple of steps. Now, I want to show you this is kind of interesting because it also resets, right? So if we go cancel and we come back into the advanced editor, it's back at its regular size. Now, this might drive you a little bit crazy, but at least it means you can get back to 100% zoom or normal zoom really, really easily. And the same thing is actually true with the Power Query editor. If we close it and then we come back in here again, that zoom will be reset. It does not persist. So that can be a little bit frustrating. I get it if you really want to have it zoomed in all the time, but I always kind of like to reset things a little bit later anyway. But the nice piece here, as I say, is that this zooms everything, right? It zooms the formula bar. It zooms the names of the queries, the, the actual window itself. You might have to start playing around with what you close so you can actually see the different things you have, but it's pretty nice that we actually do have that feature in there. So control shift plus will zoom you in in the power crew window. Control shift minus will zoom you out. Hopefully you find that useful. Thank you for watching this episode of Monkey Shorts. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to click on the Skillwave logo on the bottom left in order to subscribe to our channel. Or if you'd like to see more videos in the series, click on the playlist tile on the right. And if you'd like to get more comprehensive training, you should definitely check out our website at skillwave.training.